Hi, Long Hill Christian Preschoolers. It's Miss K here. I miss you guys so much. Hoping we get to see each other soon. I'm coming on here today to read one of my favorite books when I was a kid. I'm not going to finish the whole book today, so you're going to have to come back each day to hear more. The book is called But No Elephants. I love the pictures in his books. I'll make sure to show you. All right, here we go. Grandma Tildy lived all alone. She worked hard every day. She had no time to play. One day, a man came to her house. He was selling pets. Would you like to buy a canary bird? Asked the man. Very well, said Grandma Tildy, but no elephants. Now in this picture, what do you see in that car? What kind of animals? Hmm, can you count how many there are? All right, let's see what happens next. Grandma Tildy was cooking stew. The bird wanted to help, so he sang a song for her. It made Grandma Tildy happy. That night, they sat down to eat the stew together, and it tasted better than ever before. The next day, the pet man came again. Would you like to buy a beaver? He asked. Very well, said Grandma Tildy, but no elephants. What do you see in this picture? Hmm. Grandma Tildy needed firewood. The beaver wanted to help, so he cut the wood with his sharp teeth. Wow, it's a lot of wood. That night, they sat in front of a warm fire. Looks so cozy. Grandma Tildy went shopping. She met the pet man again. Would you like to buy a turtle? He asked. Very well, she said, but no elephants. Mr. Elephant looks a little sad there, doesn't he? Grandma Tildy was tired. The turtle wanted to help, so he carried her home on his back. So nice. How many presents does she have on her hands? That night, Grandma Tildy washed the turtle and put him to bed. The next day, it rained hard. The roof started to leak. Then someone knocked on the door. It was you-know-who. Oh my goodness. Some of the pets look happy, some do not. Now what do you see in the window there? Huh? Would you like to buy a woodpecker? The pet man asked. Very well, said Grandma Tildy. But no elephants. The woodpecker wanted to help, so he nailed the roof down tight. The dripping stopped. Hmm. Last two pages, guys. That night, they all danced together in the warm, dry house. The days got colder and colder. Grandma Tildy put food in jars for the winter. I don't like the cold, she said. Just then, the pet man appeared. Okay, guys, I'm going to stop here for today. I'm going to come back tomorrow, and I'm going to read the next few pages. I want you to talk about what you think is going to happen next. What do you think the pet man is going to try to do? What do you think Grandma Tildy is going to do? What pet do you think is going to be next? Okay, I look forward to coming back tomorrow. Bye, guys.